What hit him? Oh, it's the end. Oh, it's such another train. Yeah, you about to have a run, a train run on you, nigga. Choo choo. I don't fuck with this episode, bro. I don't fuck with this episode at all. What's poppin' ladies and gentlemen, it's your favorite, everybody's favorite anime uncle, Just Jay Sama. Yes, it is Attack on Titan time. I, I, so I purposely missed the first two episodes. Um, I have a way of when it's a really, really hype show that comes out, I'd like to wait uh, and do things via two episodes. So I already knew the first episode was gonna be fire, the second episode was gonna be talking, and the third episode, we don't know what was gonna pop off. Um, so I just like to do my reactions and reviews in two episode increments so uh this time i was a little late uh because there was a lot of stuff going on i'm gonna be honest i was just being lazy uh i would get around to watching it and then i would fall asleep so <laughs> there's that uh today we're gonna go ahead and get started and catch up on this season um so if there's anybody that's not familiar with it please avert your eyes because the first episode i hear gives away a lot of shit so let's go ahead and jump into it oh hello Oh! 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 Hello? Oh shit, okay. Ooh, they got the blickies! Let's go! Woo! You niggas thought you was getting away! <laughs> oh, he made it. I wasn't expecting that. The front got blown away. And the trench? It's hopeless. We can't dig any further. Oh, so he must have, uh... He must be connected. Because he has, uh, memories of, uh... Of people fighting titans. It will spell victory for Marley and end the war. Really? So I'm confused. Who are these guys? <laughs> this guy's fucking weird. Bro, just think, right now, there are people above the trench just getting shot up. Right now, <laughs> like, holy shit. The plan is to conquer paradise. Needs a main player. The successor of the armor titan? Hello? Okay, so I'm gonna stop it right here because from what I heard, uh, the intro actually has a ton of spoilers for the show. Uh, but of course, you don't know they're spoilers until you know you've seen that part in the show. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and skip this part. Um, intros are usually my thing; like they're super high. But oh my god, hold on! I just saw I I saw a frame. I don't need to see. Uh, I'm I'm good. So we're gonna skip right past that. Holy shit! The other side of the sea, episode sixty. Yeah, I want to know who these guys are too. Are these the Eldians or? Oh, so these are the these are the people that are uh, not on the island. They're on the mainland. So basically, this these are the Aaron's enemies and stuff like that, like the main cast. Oh, they're titans. They must be titans. Anti-tank cannons. Oh, bro, they came they came prepared. Even one of the nine. Oh shit. <laughs> Damn, the way they treat them is just, is fucking crazy, bro. They treat them like third-class citizens. Like, this is just, look at these. <laughs> we'll rush the bunker and disable the machine gun. Bro, they're not gonna make it. Also, the, they can't send out any Titans until they take out the, the train. This bitch built a bomb. <laughs> she really with the shits, bro. So she's a Titan candidate? Oh, shit. Shoot her before she turns into a Titan? Yeah, bro, shoot her. Don't even, what are you doing? You're in a war. Just shoot that bitch in the face. Yay, there you go. Pull up. Oh, hello. Okay. Bro, you're second guessing it? I don't know about this. She put it in the path of the train. Oh, she's going to be able to throw it. She just got to get it over the bunker. That's it. Yeah, bro, you got to shoot her. You got to shoot her, dog. Yup, look at your dumb ass. Look. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, what an idiot. <laughs> oh, he about to pull up with the Draco. Yeah, get her with the blicky, my boy. Ah, let's go. So this must be the movement titan they were talking about. Or claw or something. Yeah, that was one of them. Oh, and then these guys are just regular titans. Look at these boys pulling up. Oh, the titans. Damn. <laughs> nope. No, no, no. I got to run. I'm running. Oh, <laughs> Oh my god. Yo! <laughs> a 
Okay, that's kind of crazy. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bro, these guys don't stand a chance. That shit is over, bro. How did they not have an anti-Titan, like, cannon in the middle of the city? Aw, oh, shit. Yeah, that's it, bro. You're done. That's a cool tactic. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, oh, there's music hidden. Oh, it's Reiner. Oh, shit. Hello? Woo, my man looking spicy. Oh, that's it. Wow. Oh my god, look at my mans. Bruh. That penetrate even my armor? Bro, you're done. Look, he lost his whole arm. What hit him? Oh, it's the end. Oh, it's such another train. Yeah, you about to have a run, a train run on you, nigga. Choo choo. Oh, you running out of limbs, buddy. What are you doing? Oh, he got it. Never mind. Woo. Son of a whore. <laughs> I would have been left, bro. As soon as I saw them giant people start falling from the sky, I would have been like, nah, it's time to go. Damn, they took the city. What is it, the Beast Titan? Yeah, it is. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> no, not him. Oh, no. He's got a killer arm. Huh? <laughs> what? Oh, I thought I was like, yo, they got mirror force. What the fuck? Man, he's got a good arm. Holy shit. I thought they got him too. I was about to say they got him done in like that. That's crazy. As the world learned the era of the Titan domination was coming to an end. All right, that was cool. So we're going to try. We're going to. We're gonna peep the second episode here. That the first episode, I'm not gonna lie. That first episode was crazy. I was not, bruh, I'm I'm floored. I'm absolutely floored. Although I do like seeing Reiner get his ass whooped. I enjoy that. I the definitely enjoy that. I'm afraid the time has come. This uh, humanity has eclipsed the power of Titans. We are relying heavily on Titans and colonial expansion. Other nations have been developing weapons to counter us. As a result, our strategy has come back to bite us on the ass. Remain unrivaled when it comes to land battles. Yeah. He said, do we have any Titans with wings? <laughs> to recover the founding Titan? So, how, what's their plan to get the founding titan then? Do you think LDNs get privacy? Nope. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> I only have a year. The past three years, every scout ship we sent to paradise hasn't returned. But more than their titans, they're causing threat. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, nigga, you know. You know. <laughs> he over here having nightmares. <laughs> Yeah, Mikasa cut that ass up. Oh, he can just access her memories now. See, before they couldn't. Pretending to be a reliable guy. He was undercover, bro. He, he tried. This, they're really trying to humanize the other side. And I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh, that's so cute. They care about him, even though he's a piece of shit. That's adorable. I can't fuck with it, though. Oh. Man's is having flashbacks. You all right? You good? They look exactly like each other. This shit. I'm tired of seeing. You know what? That's actually bothering me. I'm tired of seeing all the all the lookalike white men between this guy, Zeke, Colt. I all all of these niggas look exactly the same, and it's really bothering me. Oh, so he doesn't plan on giving her the Titan. Woo! Drama. Ooh, drama. Oh my God! They're really trying to humanize the other side of a war. Bro, stop. Jeez, and it's like both sides think they're right too. That shit's crazy. I don't fuck with this episode, bro. I don't fuck with this episode at all. With emotional trauma? Damn. Bullets and bombs do it to you? Yeah, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> they're making fun of them because they got PTSD. That's fucked up, bro. They really don't give a shit. And then the rest of these characters are just going about their, their fucking day, man. That shit's crazy. This shit is so cool because I, I like it, but I don't like it because they're humanizing the other side of the war. And I'm I'm kind of not down for it because up until this point, I'm just thinking like all of these people are just like monstrous titans with no emotions or whatever. And then I didn't even realize like, yo, 
they're just regular ass people until you know they fall from the sky and their lifeless bodies never return but you know there, there's that too Every last one of them was a savage, heartless devil. What? <laughs> During the engine ceremony, one of them started eating a potato. Said they stole it because it looked tasty. Realizing they crossed the line and then they, they'd share half with him. It'd truly be beyond all help. He's talking about Sasha. My days were true hell. Really? Really, bro? That's how you feel? Wow. Reiner really out here. He really out here capping, bro. They're the ones who abandoned us. Are you serious? Who the fuck is this nigga? Oh. Okay. That's not creepy? What the fuck? Who is that? I guess it's just some... Oh, he's probably one of the mental patients. And he just decided to kill himself. Threw himself off the building. Yeah. And uh, like these people just don't even fucking care, bro. The Tiber family will fulfill their role. The family holding the Warhammer Titan? Warhammer Titan? The Warhammer Titan? That shit sound fire. What that nigga look like? Am I going back to that island? Yeah, bro, you better remember last time you got your ass beat the fuck up. All right, so uh, from this episode, we actually learned a lot. I, I kind of had a feeling, and I'm glad I skipped the second episode. Uh, I kind of had a feeling like where everything was going. I was like, man, I something tells me this first episode is going to be action. The second episode is going to be all talking and exposition, which is great. I love the new pacing of the show. It's actually really, really good. Uh, a lot of the issues I had with season three and season two was like the pacing of conversations and like people just be talking for no fucking reason. Like, but so far this season is, is popping, bro. All right. So we're going to jump into the third episode. I'm bro. So far, first two episodes, heat, absolute heat. The second episode, I mean, you know, it's a light simmer, but when they're talking about like, now that we have the, uh, we spent the first three seasons with the characters that these people dehumanizing, like we spent the first three seasons with these characters that these characters are demonizing. I really don't like this perspective. Like I really don't like seeing it from the other end. Um, I want to see Aaron. I want to see Mikasa. I want to see Armin. I want to see what like the squad is doing. I don't care about this. I mean, I do, but I don't want to see this because it's like, it's like trying to humanize a character that I've seen as the enemy the whole time. And it's like, turns out that they're just regular fucking people. Like, jeez, come on. Although their military is kind of shady, but you know, whatever. Who said you could walk, run, you filthy seed of swine? We're attacking Paradise Island in a few years? Why are you so excited? It's the worst. Excuse me? Your strength, your brains, your aim, combat ability. The only value they see you is your loyalty to Marley. Damn! Slaughter the island devils is real good for you, sir. <laughs> this guy's a fucking asshole. Oh, this music hits. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Have fun waiting 13 years alone. He's just mad because he's not going to get picked. Damn, he fucked that little nigga up, though. Damn, that's crazy considering, like, like while we're watching the show, the first three seasons, we're like, man, this Reiner dude is kind of tough. And then we find out he's a titan. And then it's like, it's like, oh, shit. Like, uh, he's actually the weakest out of all of the available people. <laughs> like, <laughs> I can't wait 13 years. But it's like you said, I'm the worst. He's the worst? No wonder he couldn't get anything done. <laughs> this nigga's dumb as hell. That my parents will be proud to have me as a son. Wow. Little weakling. Little bitch. On top of the mobility and endurance, it hardened strikes are incredibly destructive. The armor titan specializes in hardening. Charges at full speed, the gate at any wall will crumble. Woo! Okay, the jaw titan is an assault weapon. Okay, so the jaw titan we've seen now, the beast titan, is potent as ever. Slightly larger than other titans. The cart titan. Oh, she's the cart titan. That's the goofiest looking titan I've ever seen. The colossal titan, that's Barithold. So he's already gone. The biggest titan, a god of destruction. Sending children to retake the founding titan sounds insane to me. You think? Didn't those children crush the nation before our eyes? Yeah, I always, I, I did wonder how they infiltrated in just like, just suddenly popped up and nobody wondered where they came from. We can't turn back. Yeah, you're already out there. So this guy died before 
I was watching the show, I guess, because the Jaw Titan is the only Titan I haven't seen. I don't think Amir is the Jaw Titan, was she? Yeah, it's Emir. Oh, he's the Jaw Titan, though. How, how does that work? So where's everybody else? Oh, they got eaten. What? <laughs> she said, nigga, get your bitch ass up. Oh, so he, I guess he just gets reincarnated later because of the founding Titan. You control the colossal Titan, no problem. Wow. So my question is, they sent these, they sent all four of them, right? To infiltrate the city and get the founding Titan. What? At no point in time did they ever plan like, oh, what if all four of them die? Like, because then there's there's no going back. Like, they don't get the Titans back. That's what I'm saying. Like, there's only there's only a gamble when a Titan is reincarnated, right? No problem. Ooh. Stop them in the nuts. Stop them in the nuts. God damn. Yo, she is fucking him up. She does not want to be there. Oh, she fucked this nigga up. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, he said, I've had enough of your shit. Ooh, man, yo. Okay, so this was part two, and they broke through the second wall. This is low-key a kind of a good recap. Yeah! <laughs> Leaving behind three kids in the same age as you. Wow, he left his kids in the house, and they just ate him! It's so interesting seeing the other end. Hey, bitch, where you think you're going? Oh, my God. And then see... It's so interesting because according to everybody else, Reiner is the piece of shit. Then Aaron's just like, I want to be like you. You're so brave and you're so cool and strong and blah, blah, blah. And then Reiner's just like, what the fuck? Like, you disgusting that. pig. <laughs> Damn, look at this nigga faking. That's because he had a limited scope of what was going on. Come on now. <laughs> Damn, he was about to. He was deep throating that shit. Okay, so who, who are you giving the Titan to? That's what I want to know. You gonna give it to your cousin or this sorry-ass homie here? Oh, this is a weird guy. She's famous around here. She did incredible things in the war. Yeah, bro, I wouldn't give it to you. Yeah, but I think I think he's gonna pick him. Because uh, Reiner was treated the same way. He was the worst in his class, and then he still ended up becoming the armor Titan. So he's probably gonna give it to him. forced to march into hell. Their choice, their situation, and the others made it, made them do it. It's a victim of circumstance, yup. Damn. Hold on, wait a minute. Uh, uh, wait a minute. Who pushed their own backs to see different kind of hell? Did they? D Hold on. Did they pull a reverse? I don't even want to say it. Something beyond the hell may even be another hell. Yo! 